Okie dokie, so it's take two on uh, this gameplay with commentary, because uh, frankly, in the first uh, video, I, uh, I sounded like a three-year-old uh, running through a candy store, uh, you know, like, uh, oh, look at all the uh, gummy whales and gummy dolphins and, hey, mommy, can we buy everything in here? And, you know, <laughs> it, was, um, it was pretty hectic, let me tell you, I, I really did sound like I was... Uh, I was like a two-year-old, uh, chubby two-year-old going to a, uh, open a pizza and, uh, ice cream buffet or something. <laughs> but, um, yeah, what's going on, guys? It's, uh, it's Ari4 for Life here, and, uh, this might seem a bit new to you, but, uh, yeah, Black Ops. If you guys didn't know, I'm a crazy big Call of Duty fan. Uh, I love, uh, Call of Duty. I especially love Black Ops. I, I think that this game is is great. Sure, it's frustrating, but um, you know, a, a, every game is frustrating, and it has their they have their moments. But uh, you know, what can you do? So let me break down my setup for you guys. I'm using an AK 74U with grip and a CZ 75 full auto secondary with Hardline, Sleight of Hand Pro, and Ninja with Semtex and Concussions. And um, while I'm on the subject of equipment, let me tell you, I've been using a decoy a lot recently and it's a, it's a pretty, it's a pretty nice, uh, nice equipment, honestly. Uh, decoy is extremely hilarious because, um, it's almost like in the movies where uh, you you know here you see some people walking on the beach you know they have a they have an ice cream cone and all of a sudden the uh, the ice cream falls out of the cone and into the sand and it's like uh, it's like the uh, the fatsos can smell it just like sharks can smell blood the, uh, the fatties they can they can smell the uh, ice cream hitting the uh, hitting the sand and they all converge in on you like a feeding frenzy and soon you find yourself squished between uh, man boobs and thunder thighs <laughs> but um decoys are just are just hilarious I absolutely love decoys because uh, you just you, you throw it down and you know it's it's almost like a uh, moths to a flame they just everyone just comes piling in whether it be your team the enemy team I mean literally just it's like uh the decoy completely sets people off and let me tell you it's 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 a it's a good uh choice honestly though if it was between a uh, stun or decoy i'd probably pick stun just because uh it serves my purposes better but uh kill streak wise i'm using an rcxd car which uh let's be honest guys the rcxd car is just Oh god, it's frustrating to get killed by. It's uh, it's frustrating to use, especially when you don't find anyone and you're driving around for like ten minutes and uh, it's just not fun. <laughs> but um, I'll explain the purpose of using the RCXD car in a second. Uh, napalm strike and attack helicopters were attack helicopters. No, attack helicopter. Excuse me, were my kill streaks for this match. But uh, yeah, RCXD time, okay. So, basically the reason I was using an RCXD is pretty simple. Uh, in this lobby, there was a guy on the other team. Uh, I can't remember his name. But uh, basically, he had uh, completely stomped on me uh, four or five times and ended uh, pretty high kill streaks. Um, well, not really high, but you know. Uh, with his damn dirty RCXD car. So in the lobby, I started shit-talking him, and I'm like, hey man, look. You know, RCXD is an overpowered gun. I'm mean, overpowered gun, overpowered kill streak. You know, it's cheap as shit. How about you? Uh, how about you use a real gun, there, uh, buddy? And uh, he was all, he got all uh, offended, and he's like, "Oh yeah, well I bet if I were to, uh, if I were to face you, or if you were to use an RCXD car, I bet uh, I could own you still and stuff." And uh, Needless to say, I do believe this man either uh, rage quit or I killed him a few times. But uh, it was it was definitely not a pleasant sight for him. I hope his family wasn't in, uh, in the room when he was playing to see him uh, get slaughtered. 
So here, uh, I use my teammate as pretty much bait to see where uh, the the people in this room are because, you know, helpful tip here, guys. There's always people in that room. This is like uh, this is high traffic area right here, and saying such i think that if you were to throw a decoy in here i think the the fatty sharks would just come pouring in like rain not even kidding but um here i'm making my uh well here i'm getting set on fire cuz uh you know you know it's just that's just how i roll i don't get set on fire fire set on me no, that doesn't make any sense. And so, um, AK-74U, um, best SMG, and I don't think that there's one per- well, MP5K is good too, but I don't think that there's one person that can argue with me in saying that the, uh, the AK-74U is definitely just a spectacular gun overall and it do definitely dominates, um, the- the submachine gun family, but alright, it's the end of the game already, we got a uh, triumphant 200 to 127 win, and I went 29 and 6 with 6 uh, defending flags, thank you for watching, and um, next time around I'll bring you another uh, gameplay, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this, rate, comment, and subscribe, and uh, goodbye.